Okay, so I I actually chose to do this, so don't go calling the cops, but a cage. Oh, Welcome to season two of Vantage. We are taking our adventures off the road and bringing them into the club. Our veteran Vantager, Miss Caitlin, will be our host, interviewing fellow club members on the endless what ifs of their lives. What's your vantage point? This is season two, episode three, the one about Among Us, hair color, and sleep. And my name is Caitlin Jimmel, and here is Vantage. Today's podcast is with a lot of people, so let's start introducing everyone. I'm Caitlin, your host. I'm Jake. I'm Dominic. I'm Kobe. I'm LaShawn. I'm Caleb. I'm Matthew. Michael. Hi, I'm Renita. I'm Celia. That's our crew today. So the first question is, what is the name that you wish you were born with. Like, instead of your actual name you have now, what do you wish your name was? And it's not something like AX12, like Elon <laughs> Musk's kid, but a real, like, actual good name, okay? Jack. Okay, so this, I, I wanted Troy Corns the third, because my dad's a junior. Michael the first. <laughs> Jack and Jill. Uh, <laughs> right after her. Oh, respect. Andrew. Uh, I actually wanted Robin. Cody. <laughs> <laughs> You guys kind of want to have a complaint with your parents saying, you know, I think you should have named me this. Okay, so the next question is, since we all have like pretty natural hair, black, brown, blue, what color do you wish like your hair was naturally? Oh, rainbow. Like dark blue, so dark that it pretty much looks black. Blonde. Uh -oh. Blonde. <laughs> Brown. Your hair is black. Pink. Oh, green. Blue. Wait, no, it was red. red. Actually, wait, I take that back. Hot pink. <laughs> <laughs> Warm pink. Um, purple and blue. I would love to have my hair be silver. It would be awesome. Ooh, that would that'd be really pretty. Yeah, yeah, yeah hair the contrast silver. and everything. Imagine it was also hair. Like actual, actual, actual silver. Like, actual like, silver. like, silver. Silver. like, like yeah. That would be so And then your eyelashes would be silver. So you would have hot pink eyelashes. So then you have blue eyes with like a red Okay, since most of us don't spend a lot of time on stuff, what is the one thing you take, you spend a lot of time doing? I know, I'll think of someone else, but okay. You play Fortnite? You stole mine. Fortnite. Wait, playing my Xbox. Yeah, playing on my phone. Watching YouTube, mainly kiss high. Okay, okay. <laughs> what do you normally do? What oh. the thing do you mostly do? More watching YouTube. <laughs> um, loving my bed and watching YouTube. <laughs> Sleeping. Yes. Yeah. You can say that, that again. YouTube. That's a fact. I could probably YouTube. sleep on this like, one. The amount of time. <laughs> oh, 
Okay. Since who can sleep anywhere at, at all? Like anywhere? Like who can just? I can sleep on concrete. Hey, hey, watch it on the highest light. Absolutely anywhere. Wait, hold on, hold on. Change question. What is the weirdest place you just like fell asleep in? Oh, no. oh, oh bang! Yeah. <laughs> yeah, just shower. <laughs> How you sleep in the shower? So, I don't know. I don't know. So look, I'm playing high and seek once. I fell asleep in a car. <laughs> <laughs> no, 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 no. That, that's that's possible. Behind a bush. <laughs> Don't worry about it. <laughs> no. I'm very worried about it. Oh, wow. <laughs> don't worry about it. Um, in the chair. Now, weirdest I don't remember, but I can sleep anywhere except my actual bed. Yes. How's that yeah. possible? No, that's actually on the wall. wall. I'll be sleeping on the wall. Oh. How? Oh. How? I want to see that scientifically. I've been having duct tape on me. Okay. So I, I actually chose to do this. So don't go calling the cops. But a cage. What? Oh, oh, no. No. I, I, I said I chose to do it. Wait, hold on. Hold on. Jake, Jake, you have to explain a little bit more. Wait, hold on, guys. Let Jake explain. Explain. Okay, so my dog, I usually sleep downstairs, right? Mm -hmm. With my dog. Mm -hmm. And she had to go upstairs in her cage with because we had a foster dog. And we put them downstairs, and she's dog aggressive. So I slept with her in the cage. Question. What? How big's the cage? Pretty big. Oh, okay. She's a Saint Bernard. Like <laughs> She's a Saint Bernard. So what? Uh, this was at a person's funeral. Oh. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> you slept during a funeral. You know what? I, you know what? I can pay my respect to that. I can pay my respect to that. It was a funeral. You were in the coffin. <laughs> Who was it? Who was what? The person that died. I didn't even know the person. Okay. Oh. I thought you were okay. That's messed up right there. That's, that's <laughs> super messed up. Why would you? Why? I see you go you there. Uh, oh, my parents. It was someone my parents knew. Oh. Like, oh. my parents' friends, and we were all going. Makes sense. All right, Cookie's got the talking stick. We were at school. I was like, it was like, think, Tuesday? We were reading a book. I just fell asleep and my face was stuck in, like it was in the book. She tapped my back and I woke up and I didn't know where I was. <laughs> 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 I actually do that like a uh, real, like or at least once a quarter. But I always know where, and it's like. It happens like it feels like 10 minutes I've been sleeping, but it's only been like one minute, and it's so strange. It's so I, I hate it. I love when that happens. I know, like, literally, I woke up. It weird. sucks. If y'all don't fall asleep every day in class, no, that's no. Me, no. That's, you should not fall asleep every day in class. Please don't do that. I, I, no, I always fall asleep in every single class. The weirdest place I fell asleep is. You're out. Um, no. The weirdest place I fell asleep is, you know how, like, the rooms and everything, everyone's yelling, jumping, all yeah, that stuff? And you know how the floor is, like, super, like... Oh, <laughs> I know this one. Super Like, white. I, um, before the club layout mo changed and everything, there used to be this one couch right against the wall, and I would sleep under it every single day. Oh and, like... God. How can you fit under there? It is was it so no, it's not big. It's really small, but it was so comfy. comfy. And everyone was yelling and playing pool and whatnot. I remember you yelling a lot, yeah, Michael. <laughs> oh, when was I, this? It was like last oh, year. It was this year. Oh, for real? Mm -hmm. okay. It was before like COVID. The most recent oh. time I fell asleep when I shouldn't have was in the middle of a math quiz. Oh. <laughs> 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 it was like Friday, last Friday. <laughs> Who so takes more. quizzes on? Who gives you a quiz on Friday? Teacher. Everyone every does. Every teacher. single teacher. Hey, one year in ninth grade, you take a quiz like three quizzes every week. Right? Yeah. And, and so one day. Cool. That's just one day. You take at least probably seven a week. Yeah. Not seven, but like five. And then you get someone exams. woke me Quick up question. in the middle oh, yeah, of the I'm quiz, <laughs> and I just kept I'm writing down nothing happened. <laughs> <laughs> I'm going to drop out after the eighth grade. Yep. Um, <laughs> so. 
worst places I've is worse than the um funeral funeral was during any time there's a math quiz like you know the um math testing oh. every time I fall asleep during the writing and the math I I both of them I fall asleep every single time wait so you're just like and like it's 30 minutes and like no one like even the teachers just walk past me sometimes <laughs> Oh, oh you're the worst lucky. time was in sixth grade. <laughs> Mrs. Brown. Don't say a name, please. <laughs> Anonymous teacher. <laughs> she had to wake me up three times during the quiz, and every time she woke me up, I just went back to sleep. A different weird place. <laughs> Under a table at school. Oh, yeah. Under a table. Wow. So I can relate. I can relate. Oh, oh. <laughs> Once I was sleeping, we was like, we went to TJ Maxx then. I tried to hide from my mom. <laughs> I was in those clothes. <laughs> and I was sleeping. And I was slept while I hit my head on those things. I said, ah! Oh. And my mama came. <laughs> I think that's actually the weirdest one to fall asleep in a, t um, a store. I think someone was watching me behind me. <laughs> <laughs> like, I saw someone breathing on me. So <laughs> <laughs> oh, <my God. laughs> I got another one. What? Yeah, anything? Okay, new question. Oh, Matthew? Oh, wait. Also, you know those uh, couches like at the entrance of Costco? Yeah. <laughs> I would fall asleep in one of those. I got another one. Wait, Costco got couches? Yes. Or? Yeah. Okay, I forget what it was for, but it was for like a special occasion at a church, and I fell asleep. I think churches everyone is, in general. Just churches, a lot of people fall asleep. Yeah. yeah. I Wait, mean, it's you, nothing I'm about the topic. It's church. just like I'm it's like so quiet like now. So. Yeah, it's so quiet until the music starts playing. Yeah. <laughs> okay. Next question. What if the world was like entirely blue? You know the song like blue da da dee da, and how oh, everything's yeah. blue. <laughs> like, how, well, how would you think if like suddenly just woke up one day and everyone in Earth was just blue? Everyone? Yeah, yeah like yeah. like it's like you see green, well, you see yellow, you see brown, yeah. you see all this stuff, and then when you wake oh, up, look, everything is blue. Bro. Well, then, what the first thing you do? You I probably think you're colorblind. <laughs> I don't think color blind people just see blue. No, they can if you I just panic. Yeah. I would panic. I would panic. I would panic. I would, panic. I would start calling my mom. That's what start I calling my mom. Be like, mom, mom. I'll just sing the Smurf song. <laughs> yes. Yes. <laughs> yes. Although You're I don't know any. All yes. Smurfs. <laughs> all Smurfs. No, I'll be an avatar. Oh, you I just, no. I like I'm an open look, but then I watch it. Oh yeah. <laughs> <laughs> I don't know what I would do. Um, I don't know what I would do, but I agree with Caleb. I I sing this first song. I'll be an First, you gotta look in the mirror to see if you yourself is blue. What the mirror crack? Second, <laughs> second, you gotta, oh, second, you gotta ask everyone else if they see blue or it's only you. you and if something. it's only you, then you're going to a mental institution. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, I'll try painting everybody a different color. I don't know how. Oh, oh, yes. I like the Wait, what? That's if you try to paint everyone, every, the pink would still be blue, so they'll still be blue. <laughs> Because everything's blue. Your blood, True. Blue we happy? Wait, no that's blue. Okay, quick, quick, natural. real quick. Who said Among Us? Okay, so, so if we, so if you were blue, and everybody else was a different color, what if you were actually in Among Us? You're the imposter. <laughs> <laughs> I don't know, man. Seems kind of sus. Or, oh I'm my like, god. I'm voting. But literally, the first person who would say I'm sus is literally the suspect. Whoa, whoa, my God. God. No, oh, I will turn the tables. I will turn the tables. Next question. Next question. Yeah. What is your favorite day of the week and why? And what is the worst day of the week and why? <laughs> and it's not just like, oh, Mondays and out now, but like consistently every week for some reason, it's horrible. <laughs> Mine is Tuesday for the worst, and then oh, this day seems no. to be Thursday. No, no. Tuesday's I horrible. Think all these kids go say Monday. 
<laughs> Sundays are the worst. Oh, oh God. Sundays. 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 They always get wasted. Okay, and then Sunday you go to school. You, you know, and then you don't have fun anymore <laughs> for the rest of the day. <laughs> and then... Friday. Best is probably on Thursday because you're like, it's yeah. Friday tomorrow. Yay! Cool. Okay, so. Best. I gotta say Sunday. What? Because that's when football games are on. <laughs> <laughs> and then worse. I gotta say Sunday because that's when the Bengals <laughs> lose. <laughs> <laughs> okay, I'm, I'm right here. So. Why like Best game is Friday because it's Friday. Oh yeah, we want to watch the Friday. At school, at school on Fridays, like we have study halls and we get like free time. Sometimes. Friday, and then the worst day will be Monday because it's gonna be a long day. <laughs> it's been a long day. Okay, so this isn't a specific day, but any day that. There's an A day. Nobody in my school likes an A day. B days are the best. And to clarify, we have A day, B day block schedule. So you have one through one, three, five class on A day, on then B -day. two, four, six on B day. We got the same thing. Um, just get it to random person. Worst days agree with Matthew. It's Sunday. <laughs> the reason being. Every Sunday in my house, Caitlin blares the same song on speaker. It's like, wake up and go to church, yeah. And it's the dumbest thing because I wake up to this and I want to grab something and chuck it at her head. It's annoying. It's actually a great song. It's, it's Church by Sam Henshaw. It's Church by Sam Henshaw. It's really Best great. I just I just should play it over. Best day too much. is Saturday. Yes, not sir. Friday. Because Friday what? you still have to go to school and suffer that seven hours sitting in jail listening to some annoying facts. Facts. Sunday and Saturday, you get to wake up. You might waste it, but you wake up knowing you don't have anything to do. And you can't do anything. What's the school The whole school day is Seven. Facts. Seven. Facts. <laughs> Fact. I I agree with her. It's not Friday. It's always gonna be Saturday. Exactly. I agree. I, it's I definitely the worst it. day is eight definitely hours. Monday so because eight eight hours hours eight hours eight hours eight hours because that's the day that you gotta go to school. So unless school is canceled on Monday or you got the week off, the Monday is the worst. Thank you for your time. If you don't got no school, though, my birthday is on Monday. Exactly. Easy but Monday. there's no yeah, Guys, remember, Monday. no side conversations. It's easily Monday because somehow I overslept my alarm by an hour and 40 minutes. And then Saturdays, yeah, because I have no homework. Wait, which one's best? Wait, that's good. Yeah, you Monday's the worst, Saturday's the best. Facts. Yeah, I use an alarm. For me, Tuesday's the worst day because on Monday you have to come, go to school and everything. But Tuesday's the day you have to come and repeat it and you have to set every other day for the week. You have to come repeat exactly what you did on Monday. Monday, like, hey, maybe it's just, maybe we'll have no school or something. It's just like getting into it. But Tuesday, you have to do it every single day for the next four days. And then Saturdays are the best day just because it's Saturday. That's a nice logical day for Taco Tuesday. Taco Tuesdays are not even good. I mean, taco Tuesdays and right. chicken nuggets aren't that great. We don't even have tacos at school. Exactly. We don't have chicken nuggets. We don't have chicken nuggets. We got 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 chicken and like honest thoughts, not like, oh, I just think they're all great and everything, but like, what do you think of rich people? Me? I was the baby with my dad. <laughs> <laughs> it depends on what kind of rich person, like... Um, rich people in general. Like most, most, what well, most of them are like, instead of like, oh, I think Camila Bale is so great or something. We're not talking about one person, we're talking about rich people. In general, <clears throat> then I think... They're spoiled. Very, very spoiled. Very, very spoiled. Because, like, there are certain types. There are certain types of rich people. 
But some aren't know. spoiled, so I'm gonna give it like half credit. No, yeah, no, hey, here, here. Stop. He goes here, please, right please, here. I beg you, just give me some Stop it! Uh, <laughs> Is, I just need some money. I don't care who it is. Bro, <laughs> yeah, yeah, yeah. Actually, bro, like a oh, dollar a piece. Yeah, <laughs> no, 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 no. I feel like there's there's a good people who get it some charity, like some rappers, some football players, basketball like players, like LeBron, <laughs> RPX, <laughs> and then there's some people who go around laughing at homeless people. JK. <laughs> <laughs> yep. So that's why I have to think. Mr. Beast is golden. Okay, the ones that work for it, like actually work for their money, they're fine. But then the ones that get it from their parents or do get it because they did something that takes absolutely zero skill and they just got lucky and they act spoiled and act like they're better than everyone, I absolutely hate you with my guts. I hope you know that. <laughs> okay. So, like yeah, Matthew said, the ones that earned it are fine. But then the people that do TikToks, like I won it, I got it, and I won it. And they do. Uh, <laughs> they I, for I got a new Lambo. I don't like the color, so I uh, <laughs> yeah, destroyed it, and he bought me a new one. <clears throat> That's wasteful. Okay, so to me, it doesn't matter about their money. It just matters about the personality. But money. we're talking about rich. Okay, rich with rich money. people, the ones who earned it and stuff, they're actually well. I don't know if they're good Some people. Of them. Some of them are good people. The, like if you earn it, if the if the money hasn't already got into their head, that's an important factor. Yeah. Yeah. But the people who are born rich don't have to work a day in their life and just get a bunch of money are known as the most luckiest people on yeah. earth. Because they can't have an awful life, and I want. Well, that. we need to. That's not kind of true, because um, suicide rate in rich people are extremely high. Yeah, there's a. Well, did someone give them a little? No, ex no, no it's don't the say that. Because always being on. No, it's not just the spotlight. Most of the rich people, like if you if you look up a list a list of America's rich, a lot of pe names you won't know, but it's like the money and like the culture they have up there because you know how like over here like if you live in expanded community have a whole community there, and there's a whole rich type of like community and rich people have and that's like extremely toxic because money messes up people's heads hey, you don't have to ask money me. is the root of all <laughs> the I'm the whole yeah. money can buy you happiness if you like the so like you know how some states are like poor states right mm -hmm. uh -huh. like louisiana they ain't that popular, right? Like France. France is not a so, state. <laughs> so there's a YouTuber that I watch. He's from Louisiana. And he started off with nothing. And he has 6 million subscribers because he worked for it. He posts like 3 videos every day. Ooh, dang. That's a lot of videos. That's a lot. Every? Oh, my God. Well, it's not like every day because like, they have to like, so make Good. the videos. Yeah. But, like, it's almost every day. I and about rich people in this sense. Oh, I already said my thoughts. Earlier. Oh, then. then. <laughs> okay, so now that you see, Now... Wait, what was I gonna say? Take it. I, I lost it! I hate when that happens. <laughs> lost it! I saw this... Uh, and that's all we have for Vantage! Sorry, guys! Thank you! Vantage is a production of the Boys and Girls Club of Westchester Liberty. Have a question for our Vantagers? Message us on Instagram at BGC Westchester Liberty and at the Club WCL. Thanks for listening.